Uh, today is gonna be pretty full on. We're going out for breakfast with Annie's parents. Annie's going off for a, a final goodbye trip with another of our American friends. Why do our American friends keep leaving? Anyway, we're sorry to see you guys go. I know you're not leaving quite yet, but we will miss you. And then there's a couple of jobs that need doing, uh, which I won't bore you with. You've seen enough of my jobs. Um, and then we are going with the kids and their godparents to a, it's a tractor, a steam, some sort of tractor working farm steam vintage fair thing. Kids love tractors. It's going to be fun. The kids are absolutely loving it and they are spending ages picking mud off of all the wheels. <laughs> <laughs> morning guys so uh, normally I would be talking to you with these on but this morning it's a bit too foggy for that we'll leave those off so I can actually see where I'm walking so last night I went to the Apple store in Covent Garden for a new iPhone uh, so Unfortunately not the 7, as I've told you in a previous vlog, that my battery is... It's been playing up. It's sporadically turning itself off, even though I've got plenty of battery. Yeah, so we'll do the quick software and hardware check. <laughs> yeah, and so it's over Wi-Fi. So. I think the last time it did it, it was on 56% battery. It definitely needed sorting. Uh, I thought they were just going to replace the battery or do a fix or something. Uh, the battery itself passes the test. But they couldn't determine what the problem was, so they just gave me a new one. Cool, so I'll just make a request for the phone, um, and then we'll just swap it out free of charge for you, okay? It was a good job I got it sorted. I only had four days left on my warranty. Yeah, they were happy to exchange it. The guy who was dealing with it was super friendly, as usual. Every time I go to the Apple store, they're always friendly. No issues, just said, we can just give you a new phone. The staff were so good. I turned up late for my appointment and they said that's fine. Because my phone is full of uh, footage and pictures from my kids and all the vlogs I've been doing. It may take a while, <laughs> just, to give you, just to give you a heads up. It took a very long time to restore. They, the staff were amazing about it and they let me stay 40 minutes past closing time and one guy stuck around to make sure it had all finished before erasing my old phone. Just to make sure I'd got all my pictures of my kids and stuff back on my phone and it was all working okay. Great, thank you very much. Have a good night. Thank you. Thank you very thank much. You all thank have you. Good night. Thank you. So yeah, huge shout out to the Apple staff. They go well beyond what's required. So I'm just in the middle of editing this and I thought I'd just point out the obvious. Some of you may have seen uh, all the problems I've been having with Virgin Trains and there's an obvious comparison here. And that is the difference between Virgin, who I dealt with a few weeks ago, and Apple. 
So as some of you may know, Virgin sent me round and round in circles. And then on the flip side of the coin, you have Apple. I made an appointment with them. They sorted it out straight away and they even stayed open an extra 40 minutes. Completely empty in there. Just me, one of the Apple staff. Virgin, meet Apple and learn a few things. But I hope you've had a great week. Stay positive people and I will see you soon. Got a first car. We go cruising and detain ourselves. Still ain't got a job. I work in the market as a checkout girl. I know things will get better. You'll find work and I'll get promoted. We'll move out of the shelter. Find a bigger house and live in the suburb. Thank you.